Hey there, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Photo Chronicles. Here we are at the Tower of Mana, which is one tall motherfucker. Second only to the Tower of Salvation itself. Oh boy, a library. Everyone back off. Rain's gonna go psycho again. Keep an eye on your necks, people. Rain, are you gonna have an orgasm? Yep, it's a sale. Are we gonna have to split up again? This is bullshit. This is total bullshit, you know that, right? It is strange. <laughs> it really is like split personality. That's a good way to put it. So I've got to take someone other than Colette. Uh, okay, Kratos, you're with us. Love me, Kratos. Love me. I just have to remember I'm the only one who can heal. Keep an eye on that HP bar. Fate. Hey, Colette got a compound DX skill. What is it? Critical up. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Give them no oh, quarter. <laughs> It's an evil teddy bear! What is this, Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged? Your mother plays card games in hell. I don't know. I'm clearly high or something. Stood a chance. Not more blocks! No! Why, God, why? 
Why must we constantly have to deal with these motherfucking blocks? <laughs> oh god, kill me now. Oh good god, no! These blocks. Wait a minute, how do I ha still have the sorcerer's ring? I mean, it, 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 even by video game logic standards, that doesn't make any sense. What the hell? I mean, Tales of the Abyss knew better. <laughs> Tales of the Abyss knew better than this. Because when Ash temporarily joined the party, we didn't get access to Mew. Come on, man. Ugh, oh, come on. Good god, not more blocks! Sweet mother of Jesus, God help us all! Sheena can't equip the moon robe? Son of a bitch, that would so work given her current cameo outfit! Damn it! Damn you, game! You're being an ass right now! Lord... Lord Arceus, please guide me as I navigate through this motherfucking block puzzle. God help us all. Thank you, God. Let us never have to do anything that aggravating ever again. Fuck blocks. Just fuck them all.
disappointing. If you don't want to fight, that's something you put on. Ups max HP, uh, increased mobility during battle, of course. What else? Very helpful. Holy ring. Oh yeah, it's like the thing that recovers 1% max HP every few seconds. Always good. Always good. God damn it, Rain's having an orgasm again. <laughs> Conveniently placed bridge of light. And I still haven't found the memory gem. Where is it? Be careful, everyone! <laughs> Never stood a chance. Where's the memory jab? Where is it? We can do it. <laughs> Sonic thrust. Never stood a chance. We saved at the path, at the save point down there, so I guess it's alright. Uh, again, I have to throw in Colette because I'm forced to. Alright, let's see here. Let's uh, heal up everybody. Uh, I don't think the next boss is weakened by anything, so there's really no point in putting in Genus, so we'll just put in Lloyd, Rain, Colette. As well. Oh well, yeah, there's some equipment I need to do.
here we go. Next boss. Let's hope this goes well. God damn all this mana. Whoa, well, that's new. This is gonna be fun. Okay, so it's weakened by darkness, of which nobody can deal that type of damage. Or at least I would say that if it were. It's technically true, but I do have black quartz, so this will help. God, it's like I was over-prepared for that. Although, the Black Quartz certainly helped, I bet. But man, that was easy. <laughs> that was really easy. Something's wrong. Hubba hubba. <laughs> Sorry. Of course it talked. That's a summon spirit, jerk. Yep, that's Luna, summon spirit of light. They're one of them. 
The Summon Spirit of Light tends sometimes differs from game to game. Get out of here, you dick! No one likes you! No one likes you, Remyo. Get the hell out of here. Don't show your ugly bastard face around us again, eh? Huh? Alright. Get the hell out of here. No one likes you. Fucking light spear, awesome! That is awesome. That is just ballin'. Yes, freaking yes. Oh yes, thank you. I love this. Sight. Blame your fate. See. Let's rest here. Yep, Glad's dying again. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Colette? I would assume she's lost her voice. Oh, snap! What? Well, that's awkward. 
Well, hey, at least she won't be able to apologize anymore. Too soon. Everyone, I have something to say. Huh? I want to explain to everyone why I was trying to assassinate the Chosen. All right, we're listening. Tell us about your homeland. A land that doesn't exist in this world. You knew? No. But you said it yourself that Silveront will be saved. That must mean you aren't from Silveront. Yeah. You know, it's really a shame that your intellect's being wasted here. You're right. My homeland is not here. Not in Silveront. What does that mean? My world is called Tetheala. Tetheala? You mean the moon? <laughs> of course not. My world isn't on the moon. Even I really don't understand the specifics. But there's another world that lies entwined with Silverant. As shadow is to light, that's Tetheala. My world. Two entwined worlds? The two worlds lie directly adjacent to each other. They just can't see one another. Our scholars say they exist on shifted dimensions. Anyway, the two worlds can't see or touch each other, but they do in fact exist next to and affect each other. What do you mean, affect each other? They vie for the supply of mana. When one world weakens, the mana from that world flows to the other. As a result, one world is always flourishing and the other waning. Sort of like an hourglass. Wait, so right now Silverond is... Yeah. Silverond's mana is flowing to Tetheala. Therefore, Silverond is in decline. Without mana, crops won't grow and magic becomes unusable. If there's no mana, the summoned spirits that protect the world alongside the goddess Martel can't survive in Silverond either. As a result, the world slips even further down the path of destruction. Then the Chosen's world regeneration is actually the process of reversing the mana flow? Exactly. When the Chosen breaks a seal, the mana flow reverses and the summoned spirit that governs the seal awakens. I was sent to prevent the world regeneration from happening. I broke through the supposedly impassable dimensional fissure for the sake of protecting Tetheala. In other words, to assure the decline and destruction of Silveron? You can say that, but your journey of regeneration is also an attempt to destroy Tetheala. We're both doing the same thing. It's hard for me to believe all of this. I'm the proof. I possess summoning arts that have been lost from this world. Please don't look at me like that, Colette. I know that wasn't your intention. I don't know what I should do either. I came here to protect Tetheala. But this world is impoverished and everyone is suffering. But if I allow the world regeneration to occur, then Tetheala will become just like this. But right now you're helping us, right? Yes, but that doesn't mean I can just abandon Tetheala. I, I don't know what to do. Isn't there any other way? A way for Silveront, Tetheala, and Colette to all be happy? Hey, that's Lloyd's area. Oh, too. Have you considered that perhaps nothing that convenient exists in the real world? Rain, shut up. The first thing we can do right now is to save Silveront from its current crisis. What if we don't regenerate the world and just defeat the Desaians? Although we succeeded in destroying a ranch, we cannot possibly eliminate all the designs, and the mana will eventually be exhausted. Is mana really that important? I suppose only magic users and scholars worry about it. But mana is even more important to life than water. Without it, the land will die. Mana is the source material which composes everything. At least that's what I've been taught. Yep, that's basic RPG fantasy world principles. The giant Some magical tree source is the source of everything. Mana in fairy tales doesn't exist in the real world. We live by chipping away at the limited amount of available mana. Why do you think the ancient magi technology was lost? Because mana disappeared from the world. Correct. Magi technology consumes large amounts of mana. If things continue the way they are now, Silverant will eventually lose its mana just as it lost its Magi technology, and be destroyed. Colette? R... E... M... Ah! You're trying to spell... I'll try asking Remiel if there's a... If it doesn't work out, I may have to kill you after all. Sheena! When... that... be... I understand. You intend to become an angel no matter what, don't you?
Well, people, I think that's about time I ended off. Well, things are getting pretty heavy, huh? But we're not going to the Tower of Salvation yet. Oh, uh, no, we gotta go get Undini and, uh, you know. Get the unicorn, save the man, learn resurrection. So, yeah, join us next time. See ya.